Hi Capricorn. This is your daily for the 29th through the 30th. This is for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. <clears throat> this is a general, you guys, so of course it's not going to resonate for everyone. So take out of it what you need or what resonates with you and leave the rest where it is, alright? Don't try to make it fit if it doesn't. All right, guys, here we go. Let's see what's going on for my Capricorns. What are we waiting on? What were we waiting on? Um, something that it's like you were looking for something to happen here in the past. Um, hoping for something to happen in the past. Waiting on something. Did it pan out? No, didn't pan out. Whatever you were waiting on, um, you felt like it was a missed opportunity or either someone else felt like it was a missed opportunity because somebody else could have possibly possibly have been waiting on you. We have Taurus energy here, um, Scorpio energy. Uh, yeah, so there was something that did not work out in somebody's favor here. They feel like, you know all is lost. Well, usually, you know, that's not the situation. All is not lost. Things can, you know, you can pick up the pieces. There's two other cups back here. So if there was somebody that you were waiting on, you know, there's other fish in the sea. Or, you know, if there's, if there's an apology that needs to be made, let's do that. Let's make that happen. Because maybe, you know, then once you apologize, you'll turn around and see those two cups. Okay. That's the way that goes usually. Okay. Feel confident about yourself. Um, once you do things that you know are right and just, then you'll feel confident enough to know that no matter what you choose to do, you know, it's the right thing for you. Okay? This is knowing that, um, that whatever you choose or whatever you say, whatever you do, whatever moves you make, you know, it's right for you. This is having your own, like, moral code here. Okay. I see somebody like, I see somebody approaching you. Fire sign here. But they're approaching cautiously. They're cautious in their approach with you because I feel like you've changed. That you're not the person that, that they remember back here. You're stronger. You're wiser. Okay? They know you really stand for something now. Not saying that you didn't before, but they see, they're see they seeing um, a confidence in you that, a level of confidence that, um, that they haven't seen before. And I feel like they're a little intimidated here. Aries Leo Sag, okay? They know that you're going to stand your ground on whatever it is that you believe. They see that in you. It's like you are, you, you are a new version of yourself. Um, it's how they're view, viewing you. Okay? This is somebody that will come to you and reveal their feelings. For whoever this is for, this is somebody that possibly did not tell you exactly how they felt about you before with this moon. Um, but I feel like they are wanting to approach you and really tell you how they truly feel. If they never told you that they loved you, they will tell you they loved you, okay? If they told you at one point in time to hurt you that they didn't love you, they will tell you, no, I didn't mean that. I said that to hurt you. So whatever was hidden, they will reveal that to you, okay? So my Capricorns, that is what I have for you for the 29th through the 30th. And I will be speaking with you guys soon. We have Pisces energy. We have Taurus energy here as well, okay? And Scorpio. All right, guys.